Welcome to True Projects. In this video, we are going to explain about the project, which is decentralized secure cloud storage using blockchain. Introduction of the project. The project's central goal is to leverage blockchain technology and cloud services to create a cloud storage solution. Furthermore, the project strives to empower users with complete data control while guaranteeing robust data security and dependable accessibility. Traditional cloud storage relies on centralized servers that are controlled by a single entity, making it vulnerable to data breaches and downtime. Drawbacks include security concerns due to centralized data storage, limited control over data and its accessibility, susceptibility to single point of failures and service interruptions, and lack of transparency in data handling and storage. In response to these limitations, the project integrates solutions including decentralization of user files on IPFS nodes, blockchain AES encryption for data confidentiality. Blockchain a secure and transparent distributed ledger that is comprised of a chain of tamper resistant blocks. It is employed in this project to store memory address of encrypted data blocks, guaranteeing data security and immutability. There are many types of blockchains such as Ethereum, Bitcoin, Stellar, Ripple, etc. Each has its unique features, governance models and target use cases. We are using Ethereum in this project. Ethereum goes beyond just recording transactions. It allows developers to create small computer programs that are called smart contracts. These smart contracts, without the need for a centralized authority, a legal framework manages tasks like storing and getting evidence data. Ethereum's strengths include its ability to create various decentralized applications and its active community of developers. It continuously improves its security and many other projects in blockchain space work well with Ethereum. Objective of the project The primary objective of this project is to create a secure and decentralized cloud storage solution that ensures data security, user control and data integrity through integration of blockchain, AES encryption and IPFS technology. Blockchain technology is employed in this project to store memory address of encrypted data blocks, thereby ensuring the security and immutability of user data, as well as providing tamper-resistant, tam transparent and tamper-resistant ledger for data transactions. AES, which is Advanced Encryption Standard, utilized in this project, and this encryption works by applying multiple rounds of complex mathematical operations to data blocks using a secret encryption key transforming the original data into ciphertext, making it virtually impossible to reverse the process without the correct key. To decrypt the data, the recipient uses the same key to reverse the operations and recover the original plain text. IPFS, which is Interplanetary File System, is used to store data in blocks, which could include images and other types of files. It is a decentralized storage system that is capable of storing various forms of digital content, including images, in a distributed and secure manner. The project divides user files into blocks, encrypts them and then stores these blocks on IPFS nodes, making it suitable for storing and retrieving images as well as other types of data. To implement this project, we need hardware and software requirements. In hardware requirements, we need processor of i5 and above, RAM of 8 GB and above, ROM of 25 GB and above. Coming to software requirements, we need Node.js, Python of 3.7.0 version, Visual Studio Community version. To implement this project, we have designed various modules in the methodology. The first one is Register. In this module, users can create accounts by providing their personal information such as username, email and password. It enables users to establish their presence in the system which is essential for secure access and data management. Login The login module allows registered users to access their accounts by entering their credentials which are username and the password. Once authenticated, users gain access to their personal data and stored files ensuring that only authorized individuals can retrieve and manage their information. Upload and encrypted block files In this module, users can upload files to the cloud storage system. The uploaded files are divided into smaller blocks and each block is encrypted using the AES algorithm to ensure data confidentiality. These encrypted blocks are then distributed and stored on IPFS nodes. Additionally, relevant information about the uploaded files and their encrypted blocks is recorded on the blockchain for tracking and retrieval purpose. Download file this module allows users to retrieve their stored file from the cloud storage system. 
Users select the file they wish to download and the system retrieves the corresponding encrypted blocks from the IPFS nodes. These blocks are then decrypted using the appropriated keys, reassembled into the original file and presented to the user for download. This module ensures that user can securely access their stored data whenever they want. View file blocks. The few file blocks module provides users with an overview of their uploaded files and their corresponding data blocks. User can see file names and the memory address which are hash codes of the blocks where their files are stored. This view offers transparency control over the data distribution and storage process. Blockchain integration. Blockchain is used to store the memory address which are hash codes of encrypted data blocks created during the file upload process. Blockchain records all data transactions related to user files, uploads and downloads. These transactions are securely and immutably stored on the blockchain, providing a transparent and tamper-resistant ledger of all user interactions with the cloud storage system. Solidity smart contracts are employed to define and execute functions that enable storage and retrieval of the data and user account details on the blockchain. These contracts automate and enforce rules and operations of the decentralized storage system, ensuring to implement this project first we need to open the code folder which contains source code files. This is the code folder of the project. This is the decentralized folder. Inside this folder there are python code files that are intended to be dynamically loaded into project code during runtime. This is decentralized app folder. It comprises of a static folder, templates folder and python code files. Coming to static folder, it contains files related to CSS, JavaScript and Bootstrap files. These files contribute to the visual and interactive aspects of the application. Coming to templates, in this folder we will find all HTML pages used throughout the project. It includes pages like index.html, home.html and more representing various sections of the website. Coming to python code files that will be executed during the runtime of the application supporting its functionality. This is the manage.py file. It is a command line utility that comes with the Django. It provides various commands for managing the Django projects including tasks like running the de development server, creating database tables and applying migrations and more. Now we need to open the helloeth folder. This is the node module folder. It contains dependencies or modules needed for our project. Now we have to open it. This is the bin folder. It contains executable scripts related to the project dependencies. We have to open it. This is the run blockchain.bat file which is a windows batch script to start the blockchain. This script will initiate the local ethereum blockchain for development purpose. Now we have to double click on it to start the blockchain. Blockchain will be hosted on the local machine at the address which is the local host and the port. This address allows us to interact with the blockchain using various tools and applications. So here we need to execute the command which is truffle space migrate. Now we need to click on enter. This will compile and deploy smart contract. Truffle is a development framework for Ethereum that simplifies the process of compiling and deploying smart contracts. After running the migration, we will receive a unique contract address. This is the unique contract address. This address represents the location of our deployed smart contract on the blockchain. And here we have the gas used to execute the solidity file and compile smart contracts. This is the amount of gas used. Now we have to minimize it and get back to the main directory. And now we need to double click on start ipfs.bat file to start the server, which is IPFS server. IPFS server is started. Now let this be running. And now we need to double click on run.bat file. Instead of executing the project on command line interface, we have created windows batch file to execute the project. So we have to double click on run.bat file. The Django framework will host the application locally at the default address which is the local host and the port. This is the port. We have to copy this local link provided by the framework which is the Django framework and paste it in any browser. I have copied it. Now we will open the Google Chrome and paste the link here. At the end we need to type index.html and now we need to click on enter. 
This is the home page of the project which is displayed in the browser and this web page is built by using the Django framework. Here in the home page we can see two links which are login link and register here link. To sign up as the user, first we need to click on register here link. Here we need to provide user details which are the username, password of the user, contact number, address, email address and the address of the user. Now we need to click on register. We can see that sign up process is completed and records are saved in blockchain. Now we need to get back to login link and provide the user credentials which are the username and the password. Now we will click on login. So we can see that user has logged in successfully and here we can see various links which are upload and encrypted block file, download file, view file blocks and logout. So first we need to click on upload and encrypted block file. So here we need to upload the file for that we need to click on choose file. So we will select this word document and now we will click on open. And now we have to click on submit button to divide files into blocks and then it will encrypt each block and then it will be saved at different IPFS nodes in blockchain. We can see that files are divided into 11 blocks and we can see upholder name, file name, uploaded date, chunk name, encrypted data and and the data is encrypted in hash code and this is the address of the file stored in IPFS and blockchain. Similarly, we can upload other files and while uploading, we need to upload small files. If we upload big files, it will take time for encryption. So now we need to click on view file blocks. So here we can see that for each file, user can see file name, uploader name, uploaded date, block name and block hash. And now we need to click on download file to download the uploaded file. Here we can see uploader name, file name and uploaded date. And now if we click on the click here link in the download file column, the file will be downloaded. So I am clicking on click here link. In the status bar we can see that the file is downloaded. Now we will log out. In this, the uploaded file will be divided into blocks and that will be saved in the blockchain. Conclusion The project establishes a robust cloud storage solution by combining blockchain, IPFS and AES encryption, significantly blustering data security and confidentiality. Users are granted full control over their data, allowing them to securely upload, download and manage their files. Blockchain technology ensures transparency, auditability and immutability of data while IPFS efficiently facilitates data retrieval. This initiative effectively addresses the limitations of traditional centralized storage, delivering a decentralized, secure and user-centric cloud storage solution. Thank you for watching video. For more projects please visit our website www.trueprojects.in. For updates on latest project videos, Please visit True Projects YouTube channel and subscribe.